What's been the importance of surrounding yourself with the right people throughout your career? And what advice would you give to someone who's really trying to build that network? The hard truth is no one will give a fuck about you if you don't have something. The hard truth. Very rarely do you run into someone that's very successful that's just like a super nice guy. And it's like, listen, I don't know who you are. You're from the street, blah, blah, blah. You're not successful, but I'm going to take you on. I'm going to teach you everything. Not because they're not nice people, but to their right, they have to focus on what's going to add a value in their life. And if you are a human being that does not provide value, there's no reason that someone should give you value. So people always ask me this question because I am a phenomenal networker. And how I got there wasn't by just being in the right rooms. That's a part of it. But how did I get into the right rooms? Well, I built myself up so that one day someone invited me into those rooms. Now, when I get into that room, I can have that conversation and they know that most likely if you're in that room, you're someone of high caliber and stature so you can hold a conversation with them. Number two is if I'm around a group of bums that don't take care of themselves, aren't successful, don't work on themselves, not only am I eventually going to become like that if I keep hanging around them, but other people are going to be like, I don't want to hang around Zane. Not because Zane's not a great guy, but because the four buddies that he's hanging around are bringing him down. When I sit at a dinner table with my friends, I want those conversations to be about how are we going to help each other? How are we all going to make more money? I don't want like, bro, do you see that girl? Do you go to this party? It's like, this stuff's bullshit. No substance there.